So glad that you've joined us again for our weekly Pastor's Corner. Once again, we're using the Upper Room Devotions. Our theme this week is Transformation, and it is found on July the 25th is the devotion I'm using. I'd like to read just the last paragraph of the devotion before I share. The author says, At low points in my life, my soul has also felt dry and parched. My spirit probably has resembled a brown lawn or a dry creek bed, but by reaching out to God through prayer, through worship, Bible reading, my spirit flourishes once again. The author of this devotion talks about difficult times and how that Bible reading and prayer and worship kind of brings them back to the presence of God. You know, that works for me as well, but it only works because I can tell you I go back to a time in my life when my world was really transformed. I, in 1979, was at a rally and experienced God's grace. I didn't know what was happening, didn't necessarily want to be there. Uh, I was with a gang of young people, and uh, but something happened through the singing, the teaching, the, the speaking. I was in the right place at the right time, and my life was changed. Uh, God touched me. And I know that that experience has carried me through for years. Kind of like John Wesley, the founder of the Methodist Church, he said that he had an experience in the Lord, and he calls it his Aldersgate experience because that's where it took place, but his heart was strangely warmed, was his words. Your heart can be warmed by God's presence if you just seek Him, if you draw close to Him. Even if things are difficult right now, just draw close to God and let His presence transform you.